It's about that time. It's time to do the year review. But I rhymed. I think. Anyway, good on you guys. TWX27 in the building. I hope you all had a good Merry Christmas and uh, yeah, this is basically going to be a year review. So let's get to it. 2019. Not gonna lie, this is a bit of a, a weird year for me. You know, like, I don't know. Not a lot really happened this year. Personally, my highlight of the year was watching Avengers Endgame. That's the honest truth. There were some things that were good, but Endgame takes the cake. And I still can't believe a rat, a rat of all things, is the reason the MCU is going on. I mean, it got Ant-Man out of the realm, led to this whole time travel journey. Yeah. However, there are other, like, some good things this year, like uh, Area 51 memes, the Old Town Road song, that was pretty good. And uh, good songs in general. And some movies were pretty good, like uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, that was a good movie. And Shazam, yeah, I um, didn't do my movie review after all, but I'm just gonna give you my opinion on the movie now. The movie Shazam was good. Enough said. That was Stan Lee's phrase. Anyway, Rewind this year was super disappointing. I mean, it made the one in 2010 and 11 look better, which is funny because the Rewind this year kind of reminded me of that. It, but it's strange because that one was much better because, you know, Rewind was a new thing back then. So you would think they would improve. Other good things and interesting things, like this Swedish girl who was talking about uh, climate change in the UN. That was interesting. I forget her name though. Is it Grendel? Greta? Yeah, put in the comments down below. Captain Marvel was a good movie. Spider-Man Far From Home was a good movie. I'm sorry if I'm mentioning Marvel a lot. I. I'm sorry, like, that's, like, for me, that's what I think was just one of the good things this year, just Marvel movies. I liked the TikTok memes, like the dang, dang, diggity, dang, da dang, and I also liked the, uh, deja vu memes. Yes, I've been in this place before, higher on the street. That was pretty good. And you know it's good, because I'm usually not a TikTok guy. I think Trump has, uh, gotten impeached this year, so that's good. <laughs> And uh, for all you people out there that like Trump, too bad. <laughs> and Brexit, I really don't know what's the dealio with Brexit. Yeah, I, I don't. Because you know, like, I don't know, British politics is just very confusing to me. He was also good for Cutie Pie. I mean, he got married, he has like a hundred mil subs now, like, holy moly. That's a lot of subs. Mr. Beast did good as well. A lot of good songs this year by uh, like a little Dickies Earth song, that was a good song. Uh, just coming from the top of my head. Ariana's songs were good this year. Ariana Grande, that's what I'm talking about. Even Taylor Swift, the uh, High Hopes guy, I forget his actual name, like band name or just music name. Panic in the Disco, that's what it was called. Uh. I don't know, I really don't know what else was like really, you know, big this year, at least to me. Cause come to think of it, not a lot has really happened that much this year. Cause all I think, all I can think of was just the Area 51 memes. There were some good songs, you know, like BTS songs and, uh, and Ed Sheeran and Justin Bieber with their I Don't Care song and Ed Sheeran's uh, Beautiful People song. Another big thing from this year, the Logan Paul vs KSI fight. And, um, okay, no one hate me for this, but I actually wanted Logan to win. Not because I like that guy. I mean, I used to, but after the whole, you know, Japan thing, not anymore. I just wanted Logan to win because I just didn't want Kiss. I don't win all the time. You know, it gets boring, you know. I like to see, you know, a switch. Because, you know, like, to be honest, he won against Joe Weller, so I thought it would be funny if he lost against someone who's not a professional boxer. 
I mean, he's not typically one either, but still. Oh, I just remembered another thing interesting happened this year. The Jonas Brothers. Yeah, their comeback. Like, honestly, I did not expect them to be together as a band again. Like, that shocked me. So, that was interesting. I didn't... I... To be honest, their song Sucker, I didn't really like it that much. It was good, but not my taste. That's it. So overall, all I can say is 2019 was meh. It wasn't great, it wasn't bad, it was just meh. Things to look forward to next year. The new phase of the MCU, and there are going to be more good songs next year, I can see it, and some more good movies, like some new and fresh memes, and I'm not going to watch Rewind next year. I'm not. Like, what's the point? It's just going to be bad again. However, what I'm not looking forward to next year is this whole Copa thing. Yeah, this whole Copa thing's got me messed up, man. Even though, maybe if my channel does get murked next year, I could just restart it, but you know, it's just depressing. If I used to just do all this stuff, then you have to start all over. It's annoying, you know? But you know, it is what it is. Oh, forget it. Just forget it. I may just quit YouTube. I mean, my channel's practically dying already. Honestly, I think it's already dead. YouTube, it's just not as fun as I thought it was like. It's still fun to me, but you know, when I first did it, I really enjoyed it. But now... I don't know, the times have changed. So before this video ends, I'm gonna show you my rewind one last time. Rewind. That was a nice rewind. I'm sure there's probably so much that I missed, but you know, if I did, just mention it in the comments down below. But this is just like the year of, like, this is just basically what I've seen. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Please like, subscribe, and if my channel gets murked next year, it's been fun. Yeah. But if it doesn't, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, and uh, we're heading into a new decade and a new year. I hope for the best. Have a happy new year.